What's going on guys? Welcome back to another Perma Dad series. Today we're playing Path of Exile. I didn't make a video about it before, but this is going to be for the Perma Dad, which is going to be the hardest difficulty available. And there's actually two hard hardcore modes right now, so we're going to go with uh, I think I'm going to go with Nemesis because there uh, some uh, there's some, going to be some enemies who have more health than others. So uh, we're going to create a new character. Straight to the shore. Stay together and look for others who can help you. Let's see. The first exiles, and you won't be the last. So I have to make a choice on which character I will uh, choose. A simple job, I was told. Silence a big mouth, get a big payout, and no one was going to be the wiser. Tidy, except for one. I fought, was... wept, and bled for God and the Order. I would have died for my Templar brothers, every single one. And how do they reward my piety, my devotion? They exile me. To the land of the damned, to Rayclast. I know now that my brethren are merely God's tools. He has given me this path to walk, so I shall muster my strength and my power, and my faith. It is so, my shield yeah. against the darkness to come. I'm thinking about two classes currently. Uh, the duelist, however, I don't really like. And I'm assuming this is actually a character you can choose you if can't you own uh, a life. purchase not it. A deers, not a rabbit. You can't I mean. own a life. Not a deers, not a rabbit. So yeah, there's a few classes I do like. It's this one, this one, and uh, maybe this one. I'm not sure. I'm not a big duelist fan. I'm, I'm, I'm assuming this is like a normal mage instead of uh, this one. But mages are pretty squishy, so they probably die pretty fast. I guess I could with this one, because this one has a lot of health. Uh, shall I go with this one? I do like fancy spells though, but it's gonna be hard to stay alive against strong enemies. I think I'll just go with this one. I am a warrior. I was born to fight, raised to defend my tribe. Now, I have been taken from my people, chained and exiled by cowards who fear death. Death is my brother. I do not fear him. I see him in the eyes of the men and beasts that I kill. I feel him. Traveling beside me to this new land, this Rayclast. He will take me to meet the ancestors when I am ready. And I am not ready. Guys, I just came back. I had to check something. Anyway, there's a few leaks that you can choose. This is the standard, but you can also go for a hardcore mode. However, this seems to be even more hardcore because there's some monsters who have modified health. Uh, it seems to be that every time there's going to be new leaks that you can do. But uh, for now, we'll go with this one. And if we die, we'll also uh, become a normal character, so um, let's go with this one for now. Nemesis, alright, I'm ready. I'm calling myself Red Wolf, so let's get started. Please note that dead hardcore checks cannot be restored for any reason, including game box or internet life. Are you sure you want to create one? Yes. Uh, did I just... Hello? The check the name is already existing. Ah oh, man, why did they choose my name? So what do I choose then? Um, dark Vortex. Even that is already existing? How the hell? Alright. Uh, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know! Blue Wolfy. Wolf. Let's see if Blue Wolf is already taken. Yep. Yeah, a lot of names are already taken. This is kind of insane. Um, it's no good. Okay, let's do that. How can it be? How can this already be? All right, I'm calling myself a Dutch name, which is like a, a healthy brat. Uh, I'm also putting an L in, in there. That cannot be taken, can it? No, that's not taken. See? So that basically means a healthy bread like a sandwich with salad and all that stuff. So You've entered the toilet strand. Strand. Alright, we just woke up. We got here a club. Let's take it. Got it. We're all that made it. They dumped two dozen of us exiles off that ship. Guess that makes us the lucky ones. Luckier than... This poor bastard beside me, at any rate. <coughs> Splinter sticking out of me. Missed all the important bits. 
I saw smoke at those ruins up the beach. Go get some help. And on my chest... Sit down, boy. When I kill a man, he stays dead. So yeah, this is a Malik class. I haven't played that before, but probably fine. And I'm also playing hardcore, so I do have to keep my uh, health watched because if I die, it's going to be the end of this episode. So this could actually be a really long series, guys. Uh, it'll probably be part of 20 minutes, and I'll just record whenever I feel like it. And well, yeah, as you can see, it's pretty hard already compared to the other one I played. But yeah, I'm not going to use heal yet until I actually need to. What is that? What did I just pick up? Uh, upgrades for normal item, uh, a magic item. You call it over a weapon. Uh, maybe it was not the best to use it on the weapon, but hey, I improved my weapon, so so good. Actually, I have I have a skill now. Oh, I need to heal up. Oh man, he dro dropped pretty quickly in this mode. Well, it's hardcore, so it makes sense. So be a little bit careful not to die now. Ooh. Or it would be a really short episode. Damn, I, I'm using already a lot of heal potions just to make this part. It used to be a lot harder than what I played before. Oh, we got some armor now, so that's good. Should keep us alive a little bit longer. I'm killing all these enemies so I get level up, because I think we will need that. So I wonder how much heal potions I have. I need to regen the mana first. I'll just normal hit then. Pretty hard to see items. I wonder how all these people do that, because I've seen some people play and they have like all the items showing right away up. Oh, they press Alt. Ah, okay. So as you see, there's a lot of stuff here. A wand, small mana flask. I'll take that. A crude bow. Kill this one. So it's pretty hard so far. But I do like the hardcore mode always. I mean, some people can actually get really far. I've seen a, one person already being like a 90 plus, which is insane good. I mean, you cannot die once. I live to see another door. All right, I just got level up, so we should uh, just make sure we're not getting attacked while we do this. All right, let's see. Uh, we're gonna bleed damage, increase maximum life. That seems to be a better choice right now because I need to stay alive. So my life current is 84, and then we will we'll also go the uh, damage pad as well, but I think health is currently a little bit more important. So basically, uh, in this game you can go whatever pad you want to, uh, Just what's, you should basically go what keeps you alive in my opinion. And. Let me see how much heal potions I still have. It seems like you have unlimited. Rest one, 21 charges. Oh. But yeah, I don't want to die, so. That's a lot of enemies. I should be a little bit careful here. That's always good. There's a corpse right here. He's dropping something. Oh, it's gonna give me a helmet. That's always good. Let me see if there are more items. Uh, there's actually something. Uh, so we definitely want, don't want to pick up everything because you can't really hold that much items. Alright, we leveled that one up. Uh, what uh, maze we're using? It's also a maze. 5 8. Mine is better, so just drop this off. We don't want to pick up everything because it's. Inventory, like I said, inventory takes a lot of that. It's not too big. It's gonna be hard to stay alive. I'm not really good at these type of games. 
But hey, I thought it'd be a nice challenge, and it's, it's a little bit different than what I'm usually play. So I'm assuming these are one of these uh, modified monsters, because in Nemesis there are a few modified monsters which are stronger than normal. Maybe I haven't seen them yet. Could be. Well, we have to beat a boss soon, so that's gonna be quite challenging to do. Oh, that's quite a lot of enemies. Let's make be sure we don't pull them all to, at once. My mana is gone. Sit down, bitch. Alright, so far is good. Oh, there it is. That's the big guy. He's hitting quite hard. See, he's got extra life. I don't know if that's part of the nemesis or... Uh, let's keep spamming my skill on him. I should be able to kill him. Yeah, I got him. There's actually more items here. Let's get rid of it all. What happened here? Uh, the town entering the gate. You've killed Hello. Now enter your, your the gate for your reward. So we apparently have a shield now, which is pretty cool. Should keep us alive even longer. Uh, and identify, so I can't really use it. So here's the town, I guess. Yeah. So now we can. We'll only see people who are in the same uh, hardcore league as we are. As you can see here, if you. Uh, this guy is already level 12. And we also got our stash here now. Uh, let's first go and see how we can finish this quest that we're currently doing. Uh, let's see. What was it? M, I think it was. Yeah. No, this is something else. Journey, maybe. No, let's see here. It should be here. We need to get used to this, so. Um, hmm. Yeah, that's not what we need. Panel, maybe this one. Challenges. Anyway, let's first talk to this ne Nessa. I know I'm a marauder of Namakanui. No need to be surprised, Karui. My father and I were amongst those who tried to save your people from ignorance and damnation. My father paid for his arrogance with his life. I'm still paying for mine. I'm Nessa, and I suppose I should thank you for ridding us of Hillock, that putrid giant you felled out there. Be careful in the days to come. Karui's savagery is nothing when compared to the ferocity that is Rayclast. Lanai's watch isn't much, but it's ours. We could use you here, while you live. But should you wish to venture out, do just one thing for me. Out on the coast, amongst the wrecks, there must be a ship's medicine chest. I have many to care for, and there's only so much I can do with herbs and seawater. Okay. Uh, but where can I get this... Talk to Tark Lai. I don't know who that guy is anyway. So yeah, I got a new quest, uh, quest accepted here. But let's first find this talk choir or something. Uh, ah, here it is. So we'll get our reward. I work with Hillock. Where'd you learn to fight like that? No, don't tell me. Uh, so we can actually shoot a reward here, look. Uh, let's see. Deals 80% base damage, reduce enemy stun threshold, 70 base damage when dual wielding deals 60 of base damage from each weapon combined. Attacks with both weapons dealing the damage of both one strike. I think I should go for this one. Alright, let's get this one. Alright, uh, let's just accept all the Walls quests. So we don't Eternal have to go back Empire. in town. Ness is the I'm best not gonna show, uh, read, uh, read all the texts, guys, because. It takes too much time, in my opinion, and this isn't really a, a let's Maroc play. It's more like an um, island. Oh, seeing how long I can survive. Tarkly, Arrow, the memory. So uh, let's see. Where can you actually buy Hello. some heal potions? Uh, let's also accept that these. Is good. Best else shit. Purchase some items. And yeah, there's all like small mana flasks. So how do you fill them up with like the health? Per second. That's weird. It's like a necklace. I can actually buy it, I think. There we go. Look at that. I just bought it. Pretty cool. 
So let's see what else we got. We got this item, which I need to put into my um, weapon. And we also get this weapon, which I can't really put into anything. Does it work on your armor, or does it like, apply the effect as well? Seems like it. I don't really know if you need to put it on the weapon or not. I think it's just a crystal, right? I mean, yeah, you can take it out as well, so... Let's just put this one on the air, just to make sure that we're uh, not screwing up. And put that one on that one. Alright, I should be good to go now. We also got a new skill, apparently. So we have a few more quests. Uh, the world is there. How do you exit the world map? You. Okay. So let's see. We first have to do this one. Merciful quest. Mission. We, should go, we have to go outside town and go to the right there. And where is this one? It would be wrong to do that here. Okay. Uh, so all the talking was not any new quest? Apparently not. At least not that I can tell. No. So let's go and uh, there's no more I need to talk to, right? No, I don't think so. So you see there's a lot less people in this one because um, it's the hardcore league. It's so basically if you die in this league, you uh, your character will be transferred to normal and you can't play here anymore. But let's go. It makes me wonder if you do PvP, in like PvP cells, and you die there, will you also lose your character? I mean, who the hell would PvP uh, then? This land. Is wounded. Ooh, that's a lot of enemies. Seriously? Do I have to deal with all of them? Alright, so far as good. What's the middle mouse? There we go. So far I'm not dying yet. So we have to find out the way to... Uh... Break all the barrels, maybe we'll get some items. Drifted wood clop. Not sure what that's about. But... shouldn't be taking up all the items though, but maybe there's something better. 6-8, it's not all the same, it's just like worse than mine. Add, add to put the rocket quiver. It's probably for our arrow class, so we don't want to pick up all that junk. Could have sold it though, but I didn't. I don't even know I had this skill. Q. Apparently I do. Scroll of wisdom. Like that. Let's see, where do we have to go? Kong's canoe struck this sand. Uh, I didn't really read what he had to say. Uh, no, we have to go here. How do you go there, though? I guess we just go down here then. Iron Gravers. Yeah, now I got new boots, see? Pretty cool. Dominus wanted me to die here. I will disappoint him. 